sandwiches served. Wow. So I decided to come. What are we going, babe? We're going to Barça, Poland, on a bus. Then to the airport. To the airport. To where? Russia. <laughs> Portugal. Lisbon. And what do you think about this bus I station? I want a cornbread. What do you think about this bus station? I think this bus station is phenomenal. It's like an airport. It is. It is like a... Look. It feels like an airport. They have disco lights. Look at that. So we just had our meal, our lunch. Slash lunch, dinner. Dinner. So, and the whole meal was less than 10. It was $9.50. Or yeah. So now we're trying to get over to the airport. We had our dinner and... Goodbye, Poland. Till next time. Was, so Did you like that meal? Yeah, it was really, really It was really good. very similar to Romanian food, huh? Yes. The overnight drive all the way from... Uh, a bus Estonia, ride. A bus ride from uh, Tallinn, Estonia, all the way to Barca. How many hours? 27. No, it was, <laughs> it was like 18, I guess. Oh, wow. Oh, <laughs> well, yeah, not far. <laughs> but yes, and uh, like very tired and yeah. refreshing and uh, but. Okay. See you guys in Portugal. Bon appetit! So today is our first Sunday in Lisbon, Portugal and we're gonna go check out an elevator. Yeah, the famous elevator. Then we're gonna go eat a pasta de nata with a coffee and then later we're gonna listen to some Fado music. Yes, and we're gonna walk on the famous pink street. I don't know how pink it is, but we're gonna go and check it out. Just arrived in uh, the new one. Yeah, 
it's a much better area it's very centric there's lots of be beautiful views and so far we'll it see looks good. we'll see but we have a really nice view from our balcony this is the balcony it's a good place to have a coffee in the morning right beautiful Street. Today we're headed to Belém, which is a district here in Lisbon. And we want to ride the little streetcar, the little old one. So we're going to try to see if we can catch it. We are in a vintage van. We finally got seats in the tramway. So this place is Pastéis de Belém and it's apparently very famous, right? Tell us a it's little a bit about one. it. It seems like they have the secret recipe for the yeah. pastel de nata. Everybody comes here. It's busy all the time. Yes, uh, super busy. We, we try pastel de nata in different places. Seems like this one has the most consistency. It's like, it yeah. looks small, but it's actually very like heavy. Like heavier. Yeah. We'll try them right now. About those pastel de natas, baby. Yummy. You know, I was like not. I was thinking like the big hype, like it's a marketing uh, strategy with the secret recipe and all that. But you know what? We've had many pastel de natas in Lisbon, and this one really is delicious. Yes, definitely. It's a. It's like heavier. It has uh, probably a little bit more flavor. Delicious. It's delicious. I love it. So yeah, you should come and visit that. Pas pastel de Belém. <música> 